Hi everyone. Welcome to yet another episode of ESPN First Take. I am Sasha Fierce and I am accompanied by my partner in crime, Skip Bayless. Hey, hey. And Stephen A. Smith. What's going on, y'all? Alright, let's get started. This year was Kobe Bryant's final season for retirement. And as you all remember, he went out with the final game dropping 60 points against the Utah Jazz. Stephen A., how will Kobe Bryant's legacy be remembered? Kobe Bryant's legacy from this day forward shall be named immortal. His career was a pathway paved in gold, ending at the pearly gates of paradise. Stephen A., he is not dead. Skip, if you interrupt me one more time, you shall be chastised by the hand of thine enemy and cast into eternal damnation by the way you look nice today. As I was saying about our dearly beloved, Kobe Bryant is the anointed one. He was our shepherd and the Los Angeles Lakers were his sheep. He is the idyllic representation of a golden career. May his golden shower rain upon us for all NBA eternity. Look, Kobe Bryant is a, a good basketball player, but I want to see him win without a good supporting cast. Oh! And if you want to talk about a good supporting cast, let me tell you about my San Antonio Spurs. Oh! That, that, that is blasphemy! That is blasphemy! How dare you? you the San Antonio Spurs! The Spurs have been this, contenders yeah, I, 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 I don't even want to talk about this. Look, I understand what you're saying, Skip. But Kobe Bryant can win without I he, he put it, he been doing it for years, Skip! I, 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 I don't want to talk about this. You should be banned. You should be banned. Are you done? If you want to talk about it, I will talk about it. I didn't want to talk about it. The Spurs have been the best in the West for years. Best supporting cast you know of. Name a better supporting You know I have high blood pressure, Skip. Skip Bayless, you know I have high blood Are you Are you trying to kill me? Are you trying to kill me? Are you trying to kill me, Are you done? Bayless? You know I have high blood pressure. You know that. Are you done? Are you done? When you want to talk facts, let me know. Knock it off. When you want to throw books, I'll throw facts. No. Have you ever had one of those days you just need a helping hand? Call 1-800-TYRO. Have you ever pulled a whoop de doo and locked your keys in your car? Tyrone can help with that in a jiffy. <laughs> Sir, hey, thanks. Man, shut up. Well, wait a second. Hey! Mister, listen! No, no, please, please! Whoa, wait! <laughs> Looks like somebody's Christopher Walken. Uh. Call in the next 30 seconds and you'll receive a free Tyrone bandana. Whoa! Look who's king of the streets now. Well, moving on, Tom Brady and the Patriots are under the spotlight again. The Pro Bowl quarterback has been suspended for the second time for the first four games of the season due to the deflated gate case being reopened. Stephen A., what are your comments on that? Oh, oh yeah, let, let's just ask Stephen again. You know, he throws books, so why not? You know, let's just... I mean... Let's skip. throw some facts. Skip. Skip. Do you want to die? Today. No, I don't want to die today. Look, we know that there are some things that we know, and there are some things that we don't know. We know that we what? don't know what to know to know that we don't know it. But regardless of all that, there is no denying the success that Tom Brady has brought to the New England Patriots organization. That being said, I do believe his ultimate works of righteousness have cleansed him of all transgressions. Which clearly, clearly have nothing to do with our dearly beloved's triumphs and prosperities in the National Football League.
Look, I understand that Tom Brady is a great, a fantastic player, but regardless of his skill level, the New England Patriots still need to be held accountable. Tom Brady would have more success if he was traded to a team like my Dallas Cowboys. Oh! When the New England Patriots are remembered as cheaters, Tom Brady's skill level will always be doubted. Oh! You are so disrespectful! Don't, don't be disrespectful! Tom Brady disrespectful. will be remembered as a cheater unless he goes to the Dallas Cowboys. The Dallas Cowboys are ungrateful. Say that about Tom! Stop! 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 You lost your privileges! And say that about Tom Brady! It's absolutely preposterous! That is absolutely preposterous! Are you done? Are you done? I can admit that Tom Brady, the Patriots, can be any team with a rock! A rock! Ah! 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 Oh. However, let's Look. talk about my San Antonio Spurs. Ah! I, I, I can't even work with this guy. I can't even work with this guy. Listen, listen. Guys, come on. Uh, somebody take Where's, this man's library card away, please. That book? He is a hazard to me and literature everywhere. How did you get that again? I will go to jail right now, Skippy. I will go to jail do right it, now. Do I will cut right you. Now. I will cut you. So just do so it. I will have him take me to jail right now, Skip Bayless. I swear to God. Is your life not completely perfect in every way? Do you have any reason at all to not jump around in a sea of flowers like they do in those pill commercials? Introducing 1-800 Tyro. No, no, no. Can you see this? You see this. Let me know. Look at Are you tired of your boss giving you a hard time at work? Are you sick of going home to your loved ones in a pure state of agony? 1-800 Tyro will take care of that square of a boss at the gym. Is this motherfucker giving you a problem? You may not solve all your problems, but 110% revenge is guaranteed. You satisfied? Looks like someone's not going home for supper. You good now? Call in the next five minutes and receive 50% off your next purchase. All right, and finally, Tim Tebow has had an on and off career in the NFL. This will be his sixth season in the NFL if, in fact, he does find a home. Skip Bayless, let's start with you. Oh, I'm getting asked a question first. Does Tim Tebow still have a future as a player in the National Football League? I have said it before, and I will say it again. Tim Tebow has been constantly overlooked and underrated for too many years now. He ah! has the size, he has the speed, and he has ah! the capability. And I believe that with the proper training, Tim Tebow could make an excellent NFL quarterback. Ah! He didn't win the Heisman for nothing, okay? And Stephen A. Smith... I think that if Tim Tebow went to the Patriots, he could that, be the great that, leader they need. That is blasphemy to the highest degree! That is blasphemy to the highest degree, Skipper! You should be banned! Oh, yeah. You must be on drugs! Oh, yeah. You must be on drugs! You are on more drugs than a parentless child at Coachella, Skip Bayless! I you can are, that is blasphemy to the highest degree! <laughs> Are you, are oh, no. Tim ah, Tebow has been yeah, underrated Tim Tebow for should be years now. Yeah, he is what the NFL needs. Are you done? Uh, <laughs> Look, I've said this before. Skip. Tim Tebow should be nowhere near football skip famous. Tim Tebow, he can't grow! He can't Tim Tebow he he can't grow! Tim Tebow couldn't even do a party! Tim stop it! Goofy! No, you take it down Tim Tebow could not throw a party! Bring it back down. Alright. Where did you get that book? One more thing. Let me tell you about my spurs. My apologies for my aggressive outbursts of passion. Skip, you are a dear friend. Our companionship is uncomparable. 
I love the way your hair flows, golden like the ocean. I love the way your belts always match your shoes. But Tim Tebow, to me nowhere near a football. No, no. Um, ah. All right. I've been sitting on this set for the last three years, and repeatedly, through social media and beyond, I've constantly heard people talking about how they would love to debate on this show. Well, you asked for it, you got it. We will be starting a contest where we will take your videos, 30 to 45 seconds, airing two videos per show, and the winner at the end of the contest gets an all-expenses-paid trip here to Connecticut to spend two hours with us on first take debating on this show. I've heard all the chitter chatter enough. You wanted to debate your man? My wish is your command. <laughs> Buckle up. I hope you're ready. I'll fuck um, you all this of you. is Pac Man Abbey Chatty. <laughs> <laughs> no. Don't ever say this again. <laughs> it does. It's your multi break. So, this is our first week, so we don't really know what we're doing. Oh my goodness. You slap a big old They're probably asking where Jay's at. You gotta do it. What seems to be the problem, Jay? Hey, I need you to do something for me. You know Tyrone? Yeah, I know Tyrone. Well, check it. He stole my girl, and he's gonna fuck her long dick style. I need you to go around the block and get her back before it's too late. I'm sorry, I'm gonna have to somehow. Man, I said fuck up. you up.